Hey, what up, y'all? It's me, your boy, Lil D, coming at you from the den with another nursing video. And today, I am known as Clinical Instructor Lil D, because we're going to be talking about teaching nursing clinicals. Now, if you're trying to make some extra money, teaching clinicals is a great and easy way to do that. Now, I teach nursing assistant clinicals for CNAs, or you can teach clinicals for LPNs or you could teach clinicals for RNs, and so forth. This is actually a gig that my friend called me up one day and she said, hey, I have an offer for you because I've never done it before and I never even looked into it at this point. But she said, I got an offer for you, please just say yes. And I talked with my charge nurse that day because I was at work when I was planning it out. So I talked to my charge nurse, I got the days off and I said yes and that was to be a nursing assistant clinical instructor and these students are in high school so they're all younger 17 18 years old and once they finish in high school and they're in this program with the school they can go and take their state boards and get their nursing assistant license now i never even thought about it because my friend is the one who actually pushed me into going into this gig but they pay really really good and they pay, they pay even better for nursing students if you're a clinical instructor for them. And actually, my other friend who's an instructor, she's an MP at a university, she was offering me a gig with nursing students for $62 an hour. And that's a lot of money. I do clinicals for nursing assistant students and I don't make as much as if I was doing it for nursing students but I really do like the nursing assistant students just because they're new to the whole thing. It's all fresh and they can really decide if this is what they want to get into or not. Another reason why I don't teach nursing student clinicals is just because it gets really complicated. You know, um, they're learning by the textbook and then I'm coming in here not having any teaching background, but I'm trying to teach them how to do it but I have floor nursing techniques compared to their book nursing techniques. And I feel like it just makes the job a little bit messy. And that is not something that I want to get into. I decided to make this video today because I am going to be doing clinicals again, but this is with the same people for nursing assistant students. But instead of high schoolers, these are adults getting their CNA license, which to me sounds even better because the high schoolers are fun and it's all like new but they're a little naive when it comes to doing stuff which is also part of the fun but after a while I can be like come on just get in there and do it so I'm gonna be doing this for the next month um, two shifts a week 12 hours each to give them all their hours and it will be fast painless and I can probably even do some homework while we're there because we're gonna be there for so long and I'm not constantly gonna be rounding on the unit Working with the students can be difficult, but another difficult part about the job is the site that you're going to. Now, my first year that I did it, we went to a nursing home and the staff there wasn't so accepting of the students. And there was actually like a couple times where my students, which they shouldn't, got in an argument with the CNA that they were with, or there were certain CNAs who didn't want students, which really limited us because it wasn't that big of a facility. So it made it that much more difficult. The following year we went to it, which was this year, we went to a new nursing facility and everyone was really accepting. They really liked the help that the students were giving. So I felt like that made it a lot easier. And this next place that I'm going to next month has really good reviews online. So hopefully it's good and they're accepting of students and they just take their help in for what it's worth because it can be a lot of extra work on the actual staff in the facility and they don't get paid extra to have these students shadow them for the day. But hopefully the people that I'm teaching aren't just shadowing and they're working, which is good for everybody. That is it for this video on teaching clinicals for nursing students, CNA students. If you have any questions, leave them in the comments down below. Make sure you hit that like button and make sure you subscribe. But I'll talk to you guys later. Thanks. Bye.